Good morning, Vietnam. Uh, when you cut the etheric links with the, with the stuffs that you are feeding, uh, the egregore of your uh, country, maybe, you know, your flags and your, you know, anthems, you know. You know, all, all this bullshit. When you cut uh, <coughs> the energy going to your uh, shitty religion, you know, um, when you cut the energy going to your football team, maybe you're, you know, supporting or something, you know, or your group, your human group, you know, or your animal group. The family, you know, these uh, structures of uh, egregore. The, the egregore is very hungry, the family one. When you cut the energy, you have it back to you, okay? Uh, so, it is real energy, okay? So, you may notice uh, that the cold, for example, you, you don't feel cold like you used to outside in the same temperature. Oh, suddenly you are hot, you know, you don't feel the cold. You, are, you have more body heat. Okay, so it is real energy <clears throat> that is uh, modulated to go toward those uh, egregores, uh, vampires. So there is a whole business of energy. Uh, going around the human being okay so it is like i said real heat real light you feel it as heat in the body but it becomes modulated and it goes to another dimension you know feeding your um, you know the, the different egregores you are uh, subservient to you know it could be uh, it could be the rolling stones you know those uh, testosterone grandmas you know squirming and wiggling around you know they are getting some energy this is why they continue the business okay yeah so you will have this energy back <coughs> and also maybe uh, the food that you eat suddenly you know you feel like you are eating you know it's not like an empty black hole all this food you eat and you wonder where it is going why, why I'm so weak or skinny this is because this energy is modulated from your body and sent into the other dimensions the energy of your food the energy of the cake you see in the picture this cake when you eat it there is a percentage of it a part of it going feeding the you know the egregore business you are in okay the multiple egregores you know yeah like i said countries religion family football team rolling stones whatever okay so we can now imagine that uh, those human beings are made for this shit okay eating food, eating materialistic food and um, send it as an energy to immaterial dimensions. We can think about it as this, you know. So is it another new conspiracy theory that I have to invent for, for the internet, you know, like there is not enough? Yeah, the conspiracy would be like the human beings are engineered genetically you know they played with their uh, italian pasta in their cells and they made them this you know maybe they were just monkeys you know they played they gave them a brain a brain that can contact contact the immaterial realm you know with belief system with the you know praying religion all this energy so they put they modify the monkey and they come up with this dumb ass as human so they give them this uh, you know this brain stupid brain you know they think they are smart but it's uh, 
smart slash stupid. This is not, not, nothing is smart when you cannot even monitor your own energies where they are going. You cannot even see your your energetic bodies where they are. You cannot even see it, you know, with your awareness. Even your Buddhist awareness ca cannot achieve it. You know, you have to go higher level. Okay, so maybe they engineered some monkey to make it this, you know, and they feed him the supermarket food, the cakes, so he can, you know, modulate, transmute this into energy <coughs> that is feeding the other dimension, which will be a very possible scenario. <coughs> Yeah, so this is why the human is here, taking the physical energy and make it more etheric and feeding those <coughs> creeps. Okay. Yeah, that's the story. Everything is this. And all what you imagined, your religion, your spirituality, is, all of this are, you know, the result of this stupid slash smart brain that they gave you this in between we can think how how this animal was in you know the eden he was in paradise just eating food you know and he ate from the tree of knowledge okay the false knowledge okay the the knowledge of this stupid brain connecting him to to the rolling stones to the wiggling grand mass so they can eat some cake you know, maybe the story is old, very old business of energy, sucking you dry. Okay, so learn, learn to monitor your yourself, all your body, your energetic body. Cut, cut the energy. We need consciousness, relationship with uh, beings, powerful beings, very vertical. You know, very responsible of the energy, of the energy of the others. They don't dig there. You know, they don't play this game. Okay, because when you see it, all of it, what what you watch in the media and everything, are mind game. Little bit of, you know, animosity, violence here. You know, in the movies, in the news, everything is playing with these energies subtle energies and then you go you feel your belly and you feed it more okay because maybe you are made to do this okay isn't it a good conspiracy theory yeah i think it's a good one yeah this this should do millions of views okay okay yeah of course it will yeah so what to do is really be in control of yourself but uh, not in a, the control is not with force. The control is when you see the mechanism. Okay, when you apply real awareness, not the awareness of the Buddhism. Okay, not this one. The awareness of the Buddhism is not pure because it is played with the, with the, a background frequency which is judging this reality, judging that the world is, the reality is all suffering, it's samsara and cycles, and it's all suffering in permanence, all this is belief system, when you play the note of your piano, your consciousness piano, you play awareness, and you mix it with belief system, it's not the awareness, it's not its pure form, it's not the one that will make you see, okay, because the, the Buddhism, they retract, they retract from from the physical world. They retract from the mechanism of their bodies. You know how the etheric energy is moving. They just everything is dismissed, like or rejected as being impermanent, illusion. Okay, so they don't go deep enough. They just collapse inside, 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 inside the cavity of the lamp. We don't want to collapse. We want to be. Uh, as aware as as possible in in all directions okay so this is where you see the you know how the energy is moving you can see 
<clears throat> very fast you know phenomena you can see the energy the light the primary light before it becomes your atavism your instinct you can catch it in this microsecond before you can do this when you play the real note of awareness on the piano of your consciousness it has to be pure okay it has to be free from judging free from the false knowledge free from your smartness okay smartness of of a monkey you know it need to be conscious very very conscious limitless fearless it's not afraid to go down in the matter okay down in the subconscious of the matter through through the, the lamp through the body the contact this is on where, where i said in the, in the other video where the cavity of the lamp where the consciousness in is in the lamp which is the body the contact between the two it's there where the you know awareness has to go and enter beyond the senses which are in the cavity the plateau cave we have to go through and go down go down in the matter also okay you will see you will see the energy is flowing in your form okay you will see how the light is modulated into into atavism into instincts into the body mechanism you will see the energy it comes from everywhere it comes from under from under also from the other polarity of the divine of the big electron from the matter also it's radiating through from the body there is a huge quantity of dormant energy and from the top also it is the primary light is modulated into your different subtle bodies mental body energetic body emotional etheric you have to see that this kind of stuffs you have to play a pure awareness on your position of consciousness you know the instrument of your consciousness consciousness is infinite those buddhism learned two two tricks two position but they don't even play it pure okay they play a background note you know you know which is distorting everything distorting the pure awareness okay so eat the cake okay but eat it for you not eat it for the the egregores okay game over it doesn't matter the origin of the human beings doesn't matter you know doesn't change the equation with the you know all this the fact the fact of the being is the most impo important doesn't change anything who is the parasite who did what in the past the power is here because we are in that level of consciousness great power into us many 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 stuffs are afraid of us you know many limitation inside of us are are the fear itself the fear of collapsing the game crashing the game okay did, did you see the kids i put the link the kids of tetris they play tetris you know this game they became so fast one of them came with the technique you know to to roll his fingers under the the gaming pad and then they shifted into other levels of speed all the old players you know the 30 years old they were all wiped out by kids now you know their speed is incredible one of them crashed the game and then three days after another one did it and then another one did it the hundred monkey you know phenomena one does it destroys the limits and then it's open okay so what i told you here is to claim back your energy i am doing it the moment you master it you master it for all the humanity it becomes more and more easy you open the door when you when you do something new you open the door it is the morphic fields has been monitored studied by a by guys like Rupert Childrek and others okay the moment you break a habit, a habit you enter something new it is more easy for everybody okay claim your cake okay eat the whole cake just for yourself see you in the next video